Hello folks and welcome to your first video tutorial about how to work with the Wings Week fuselages and Wings Week data. So what we're looking into today is um, to evaluate and work out the actual thrust velocity of our propulsion unit which obviously encounters the motor and the propeller. Um, what I'm trying to do is to measure two different distances as well because obviously as we are getting away from the actual propulsion unit we are decreasing the thrust velocity because of friction. And, and what I'm trying to work out today is the thrust velocity that the actual tail section is seeing. So I'm going to have the wind speed measuring device um, very close to the tail section of a certain distance. And I'll be after that looking into a closer value of closer to the propulsion unit as well. The setup for today is basically the fuselage as you will get it. Um, it's got a fully charged battery, so we're looking at full power um, power supply from the motor itself. And after having done this, we're looking into the actual thrust that is produced at full power as well to give you the values to calculate, calculate with. So that is actually quite a clever, clever device here. It tracks the maximum velocity, so I don't have to look at it all the time. So what I'm doing is I'm going to do the first measurement fairly close or very close to um, the tail section to see how quick the velocity is, is back there. So let's see what it does. maximum value. I read 13.8 meters per second, very close to the tail. Now I'm going to reset this one and we're going to be doing another measurement about 10 centimeters aft of the propeller and see what the difference is there. Okay, we're ready to go. So that's about 10 centimeters aft of the propeller. Same setting, full power. So this reading is 16.1 meters per second. Now you've got two values um, of a different distance and you can either take the average for calculation or the actual value that is seen by the tail section in terms of working out forces acting on it as well. I hope that was of help. Thanks.